Hello everyone. Um, right, okay, I'm back. It's 2017. Um, first things first, bit of... I, sorry, I haven't put anything up. Um, mainly because I haven't done anything. Um, had a few personal issues so far this year um, that have basically made me lose my mojo and I've just... Just things going on in personal life that have just taken over from the hobby for the time being. And it's... Um, yeah... But hopefully I'm back now after a couple of weeks of just moping around. Um, and yeah, back up and running. So, but I'd also like to take this opportunity to sort of thank a few friends um, who've been quite supportive, even if it's just chatting to me. And even if I've been feeling a bit down, you've chatted to me and you've, you've, you've actually been really supportive or text me or whatever so you know who you are um, and I know you'll probably be watching this so thank you all of you for helping me through my bits and pieces um, but yeah so on to more important things the things that you really want to know about are things like what I've been up to so got back into doing stuff and so if you have a look I did a bit more Napoleonic stuff I did this guy who I needed for a game and he is a I've made him out as a Prussian ADC um, which is a Perry figure sorry about the focus so yeah enjoyed doing that then yeah had a few games of General de Brigade getting into that with a few friends of mine so that's been quite nice um, still going on with the Hussars but as I've taken a bit of time off I've not painted much of them I got all these together which are what my son got for Christmas um, which are all the figures from um, Empire of the Dead which I'm gonna paint up as soonish let me see if I can focus there we go so I've cleaned them all up put some bases on got them ready so there that's that done so then they need to be primed and got ready and then at which point I got a bit of a thanks to Nick British Legion for these he sent me along these he had some of these and he had Lady Luck Queen Victoria and this is a butler of some description and he sent me them to go with the my son's Empire of the Dead stuff which is very kind of you thank you very much Nick and then a last thing which took me by surprise and actually gave me a bit more of a lift and has sort of like um, boosted me on to want to do some more hobby stuff after my f beginning of the year. So, and this was from Sven. Um, some of you know him as Tristan and some of you know him as Athelith. Um And I got this. This parcel. Oh. This parcel through. And I thought, what the hell? Is it? Where's this from? So I opened it all up. And we, it's very, very generous. I ended up getting... Now, you'll all be quite surprised at this. And you can see all that. Uh, goblins. Now, this stems from a conversation we had about fantasy. And I don't do fantasy, you all know that. And he said, oh yeah, you need to. And so he sent me basically a goblin, night goblin starter army. So saying, I can do with it as I wish. Which is extremely kind. And now, I've got some of these. Which I think are actually forest goblin spider thingies. But I'm going to use them all for the same. So it doesn't bother me. So... So I've got about eight of them. I've got loads of spearmen, loads of bits and pieces. So, yeah, took me really by... And actually gave me a real lift. So, Tristan, thanks very much for that. Super generous, and I will be doing something. And in fact, I already have. I did a little bit of a play around, because, you know, I like doing test figures before I do anything. And what I've done, I've done a test figure of one of these little goblins. 
Now I looked on the websites and a lot of people paint them black with yellow shields, so I clearly have not done that. And I thought, what would a dark thing wear? And so what I've done... I've painted in purple. Purple cloak. And well, I've done a black shield with a really quite vivid white moon on the front. And I, I really like him. He didn't take long to paint. I really like him. So I'm going to paint most of mine like this, I think. Or I might change, from unit to unit, I might change the colour of the moon on the um, shield. Or maybe even the, the gown. I don't know. But yeah, for the first unit, he's going to have a purple gown with white shields. So that's what they're going to be. And so, yeah, quite a nice little project that... Is something completely different to I what I normally do, so I'm gonna have a go at that. And thank you very much, Trissa. It's super generous of you, um, and you'll obviously see more videos as I get on with them. But I think my next thing is I've got to carry on with these hussars, which I've done four of, and I've got another eight to do. So I want to carry on with them. And then I'm going to get into the Empire of the Dead. And, the, and I think I'm going to have a go with these goblins as well. So that's my plan in the near future. Um, I, have been, I have been watching videos as well. I've not been commenting quite as much recently. But anyway, it's all good, great stuff. And I hope everyone, everyone's new year is starting well. And um, yeah, I will see, speak to you all soon. Bye.